Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Venture Senior from Pod6 Club, joined with Genzo the Gamer. And we are back for another episode of Versus Boosted, Dominaria. Alright, so we're going to be continuing on from where we left off. We're at the halfway point now, and we're still continuing on from our original boxes. Yep. So, I think without any further ado, let's we'll do this. Start cracking, and I'll explain how it's going to go again for anyone if this is the first episode you're turning into. Essentially, we're pairing, yeah, comparing any cards that are over $2. See, it's not even card names that mess up. I just can't even, like, say normal words. It's evident in other videos. Hey, man, English. I, I'm, still, I'm still learning it myself. Yes. So we, <laughs> so we will be uh, only basically looking at rares, mythic rares, and... And Dampian Sphere. Actually, that's not true. We will count all. We will actually count all rares and mythic rares, regardless of price. That's true. But we will only count Dampening Sphere towards our total. The only worthwhile uncommon at the moment, and yep. hopefully when we're doing this, because at this point these prices are several weeks out from release, even though this is pre-release weekend that we're opening this on. So, without further ado, and rule. Mansplaining. <laughs> Just trying to clarify things. You know. I've got an isolated chapel. Nice. I have myself a goblin chain whirler. Nice. Which, yeah, I'm excited for that one for mono red aggro. Nice. And also a push for uh, goblins. That's going to be sweet. All right. Continue on. Oh, yeah. However, I'm still hyped over this one. Shout outs to Yargle. Yargle. Yargle! Yargle, Yargle Schmargle. I still want to get a play set of Yargles. Maybe you will? Who knows? Maybe, maybe some foil Yargles. That would be awesome. Ooh. That's Sarah. Nice. Angel. Shiny, shiny. This, this ordering is still kind of weird. I'm getting used to it now. It still throws me off. Jaya's. What is that? <laughs> Immolating Ladies Inferno. Inferno. Oh, Jesus. Nice. And I have myself a helm of the host. So, kind of matching up on these ones. Yeah. Yeah. Both legendary rares. Mine and artifact. Here's a sorcery. Sweet. Continuing right. on. Mythics. <laughs> yes. I think I only let's had one mythic so far, actually. This whole box. So far. I mean, they're probably saving the best for last. Hopefully. It can't open this. Ah. <laughs> there we go. Just go savage on it. Savage, indeed. All right, moving through the commons into the uncommons. Anything worthwhile? Nope. Not the one we're looking for. However, you're uh, rare. Track socks, scourge of Krug. Krug. Nice. And I have myself a Yog Moth's Vile Offering. I love how good I am with all these names in the set. <laughs> <laughs> it's all these throwback things, man. These are cool. Yog Moth, Krug, all that stuff. Alrighty, that's three packs. Yep. Third of the way in. Mm -hmm. Keep going. Next three. Oh, I got a Zalarian Scholar. Nice. <laughs> I still feel like they should have put uh, the professor from Tolarian on there. That would have been hilarious. That would be. <gasps> ah, man. I got my second Damping Sphere. These things are sweet. I can't complain about that. Oh, okay. And what do you have, good sir? I have. A Muldroth the Gravitude? You have a Muldrotha the Grave Tide. Yeah, I did. But you got a mythic yeah. and a pretty sweet mythic. Yeah. I have myself a Siege Gang Commander. Nice. You wanna hold up that one? Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. And Thank you. Ah! It's falling over. <laughs> I also happen to get myself a foil. Nice. Navigator's compass. So sweet. Good pack. I'm not complaining. All right, we gotta keep going. Yep, we're still rolling with these. Ooh, and a dub. Keeping those lights going. 
Sarah's disciple. Got her disciples now. <laughs> it's the cult of Sarah. I knew it was going to happen. First time I saw Sarah Angel, I'm like, she's going to be a cult leader one day. <laughs> Again, I like these callbacks. Sage of Latinum. All right. I got Dread Shade. Nice. I have myself a Marwin the Nurturer. <laughs> Nice. So a rare legendary. Pretty cool. Oh. And I also got myself Jeez. a foil opt. Oh, wow. Nice. That's pretty sweet. I don't even hold the cards anymore. I want to put your roll. You're just so excited for Dominaria. I'm excited. I'm so excited that I got up early and we got our packs. Yeah. We uh, we were at the uh, local game store pretty early today. Because they, op they opened early, too, because they're doing the pre-release. Actually, I don't yeah. think they closed, to be fair. Yeah, considering that they did the midnight and they had well over hundred, they had over a hundred people there for that. So and it was that's in. awesome. Ooh, dampening sphere. Nice, nice. So cha ching, there we go. Damping sphere. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Hmm. All right. Oh. I got a unwind foil. Very sweet. But I got. Zidhad Jinn of the Lamp? <laughs> Zahid, Zahid Jinn of the Lamp. Yeah, yeah, Very nice. Like that. <laughs> and I have myself a Phyrexian, Phyrexian scripture. Ooh, nice. Which is a mythic. A mythic saga. So that's pretty cool. And then I also did get some pretty sweet uncommons along with a Raft Capuchin ship's mage. I'm happy with this unwind, actually. It's yeah. sweet looking. The foiling is nice. I like the foiling, and I mean that that is one of the things that apparently they did change. Is the foiling? Well, no, is the uh, the coding for the cards. So that might have right. affected the foiling, it right? It may have, yeah. As well as they claim to have to fix the uh, card, card quality stock, yeah, yeah. issues, but I have Let's no see. idea. Maybe better quality control? Maybe. Maybe. I mean, honestly, I haven't had. I've had less. Like weird printing issues. I haven't really yeah. seen any other than I tried to pick it, like I've, I've someone was on it, yeah. but I've seen a few blotting things, but nothing that's made me go, Ugh. Oh, hey, hey, ho, dampening sphere. Nice. That's two ETH this time, eh? Sweet. On a roll, dude. And? And I got a Sulfur Falls. Nice. I have myself a Primeval's Glorious Rebirth. Nice. Very nice. And I still like these uncommons. Me too. Yeah, a ship's caretaker. I Very much a... reminds me of uh, Kaylee from uh, Firefly. <laughs> I have myself a Merfolk Druid. Nice. Alrighty. Tat Tatiova. Wait, was that the last one? Benthic Druid? No, we still have two more. Two more. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, man, I'm tired, dude. Sorry. All good, all good. Uh, I just want to go through and open the rest of what, these. What it is is because I've, I've got my watchmouths in there. Dapping Sphere. Jeez. You got, yeah, you got two of those, so those are kind of throwing you off. Hey, I got a Sarah's Disciple. I told you she's a cult leader. <laughs> no. <laughs> You're not going to let that one fly, are you? That's the Cabal, man. No, that's not how Sarah rolls. Yeah. <laughs> She's an know. angel. <laughs> All right. Angels can't be cult leaders? Well, I guess that's... <laughs> okay. I, uh, yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. Darling archaeologist? Darling or daring? Daring, sorry. <laughs> okay, a daring archaeologist. And I have myself a territorial Jeez. allosaurus. So, dinosaurs. Nice. In Dominaria. So they still have dinos. They're rocking that theme still. Still keeping it going. Well, I mean, they did go through and retcon a bunch of old right. cards that should have been dinos into dinos. That's true. Well, you gotta get that. You gotta get that meta going for at least commander. Yeah. And I mean, to be fair, something like fungusaur that wasn't a fungus. That was a dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> true. All right, last pack. Last pack, indeed. And. Moving through the commons into the uncommons. Is there another damping sphere? Nope. But what is there? What'd you get for the sweet room? And that's something that you've seen already. 
Phyrexian scriptures. Nice. Mythic Saga. I have myself a two-headed giant. Hmm, nice. Very cool. Sweet. Yeah. All right. Well, that's that's another episode. We've got one more remaining after this. But for this, we got to see who's won. So yep. we calculated it all up, and we know that the winner is... We have no idea who the winner is now. Yeah, we have no idea, but you do, and we will find out later in the edit. But if you'd like to find out what happens in the final episode, we're going to open the last nine packs of our booster packs, crown a winner for that episode, and an ultimate champion. Overall winner of Dominaria versus Boosted. All you got to do is, well, come back and watch it. But if you want to make sure you know about that, you can hit that subscribe button. Which, if it's, you know, not red for you as normal, it means you're subscribed which we thank you for, but there's also that notification bell that you can hit if you want to really make sure you don't miss it. It's up to you. Indeed. And as always, we'd love to hear about what you got from your Dominaria pulls. And any of the sweet pulls that we got, and what you are looking forward to brewing out of all of this. So, that's been another episode of uh, Versus Boosted. I've been Dr. Venture Senior for Pod6 Club. I'm Gans with the Gamer. And we hope to catch you in the next one. Uh -huh.